Hello y'all, it is the middle of the afternoon and I just got tired of sitting in front of my computer doing all of these Zoom lectures. Thankfully, I finished watching all of the recorded lectures for today. I just need to do some review of those lectures, some of my typical studying habits, which I talked about in my last video. So I'm just gonna be going through that process, but I thought I would take a quick mental break. I wanted to show you guys some of my favorite app moves because I might have posted a bikini photo on my Instagram and I got a lot of comments asking me what sorts of exercises I like doing. So I am going to show you some of my favorites. Core is something I always love working. So I'm gonna show you some of my favorite exercises and I hope you'll try it out and do it with me. is going to be so busy okay where where do i start basically i have a full day of classes so from 8 30 to 5 30 i have scheduled classes i'm also going to be leading a clinical case session with my friend darren but i'm actually also picking up a dresser from someone on facebook marketplace this is actually the first time I bought something on Facebook Marketplace. The thing is, I'm pretty sure it won't fit in my car. So in the middle of the day, I'm gonna have to drive to my parents' house, pick up their SUV, drive back, pick up the dresser, then drop off the car. So that's gonna get in the way of my normal lectures. So it's a little bit stressful, but I'm really excited to have this dresser. I'll give you guys an update on what the bedroom looks like because we're also getting some sconces that should be coming in tonight. I'm really excited about how this will hopefully transform our space. I just want our bedroom to feel serene and calm and light. So 
I am excited to keep working on it, but yeah, I'm gonna try to get a head start on my day by listening to my first lecture a little bit early. And I will keep you guys updated, but I'm just gonna try to be as time efficient as possible. I still need to prep the session that we're leading, so I might do that like 20 minutes before. Um, but yeah, it should be a good day. It'll be really busy, but I think it'll be exciting. Come. A fashion atrocity. <laughs> Things did not go as planned. My mom's car had one of the warning lights on, the red one, the one you should not drive with. So my plans are completely out the window. I have no idea how we're gonna pick up the dresser. I'm panicking. <sighs> Just some casual updates on the tragedy and the drama that was this afternoon. Today, because I couldn't drive my mom's car to go pick up the dresser, I spent an hour just driving to my parents' house for no good reason, and it's no one's fault, but I was still just so mad and annoyed that things just didn't work out the way that I wanted them to. I still had classes, it just did not feel like a good use of my time. Thankfully, one of Justin's friends has a big truck, so he is going to go bring the dresser over. Honestly, it's just an Ikea dresser, it's not even that big, but it just wouldn't fit in my small little car. They went off to go pick up the dresser. While they're doing that though, I wanted to give you a quick look at the bedroom and what we are hoping the vision will look like. Right now, this is what our bedroom looks like. It's pretty plain. There are still some boxes and things that we kind of just haven't unpacked because we haven't had space for it yet. We bought a new bed frame that's an elevated platform. So it's a lot more minimal because there's no big headboard and that's kind of what we want. We we want something to feel light and airy. I'm hoping to get some new bed linens to lighten up the room a little bit. As you guys saw, we went downstairs to pick up these two packages that I ordered from Article. These are some black lamp sconces. So I'll show you guys what it looks like when we unpack it. Hopefully we get to put them up tonight. And these are going to serve as our bed lamps. So hopefully they just go up on either side. And then I'm gonna turn you guys around. So we have this space here because we ended up selling our chair, which was in the corner because it just felt kind of awkward in the space. And I feel like what will be really nice and really useful in this space would just be a dresser because I definitely need more storage for clothes and just general other miscellaneous items. I found a dresser from Ikea. It is the Malm dresser, and normally since it's an Ikea item, I would've just bought it from Ikea, except I want it in a specific oak wood to kind of match like this sort of wood, like a very light wood. That's the kind of vibe we're going for, and they actually discontinued making the Malm dresser in oak, or at least they're not anywhere near us. I was really excited to find it on Facebook Marketplace, and it was also being sold for a really good deal because the owner is moving cities today. So that's why I'm kind of in a craze to get this dresser. In the meantime, I'm going to try to get some more work done. It's just been such a hectic afternoon, so. Oh, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, it should be nice. Justin's friend is probably gonna come hang out with us for a bit, maybe join us for dinner. And I will be sitting here working on my lecture notes. So, each to their own.
good morning everyone i am just having some breakfast some orange juice and some bacon i wanted to let you guys know that our apartment is such a mess we ended up having dinner with our friends last night and it was so lovely. We didn't get to bed until pretty late so I'm feeling a little bit tired today. Technically, I have a full day of classes as well as some review sessions but I think I'm going to skip those review sessions just because it's been a really hectic week. Like we've had so many hours of classes. Definitely need to prioritize my studies this weekend but for today, I needed a break. So I'm gonna use that break to do some more work to go for a run and just kind of give myself some time i wanted to end this video off but before i do that i want to give you a quick bedroom update last night we spent like half an hour installing the lamps and i really like it at first i was kind of like mm, they feel a little bit big but we do have really high ceilings and they make such a statement. Um, also, we have our dresser here. I need to fill this up with things. Very far from my vision of what I hope it will be, but we are getting there and that's what's really exciting. I also wanted to give you a closer look at these lamps because I think they're really beautiful. They were definitely more of an investment piece from Article, but I love the shape of these lamps not gonna lie i made a joke that they look like nipples and now it's kind of cursed for me but i also still love them because they have this asymmetrical sort of hem and you can adjust it which i think is really cute and it's nice because since it plugs directly into the wall you can just turn it on from here and it's super handy i'm really obsessed with it i think it looks really good and there's our dresser. So I know it's hard to see right now, but let's just envision lighter bedding. We're gonna change the blue, and it's gonna be airy, very airy and light with some statement lamps. That's the hope for it at least. Anyway, I am going to go finish up my breakfast, but thank you so much for watching today's video. I really hope you enjoyed seeing this vlog of a few days in my life. Make sure to subscribe for more vlogs of my life in medical school, and I will see you very soon in my next video. Goodbye!